Hey everyone, I'm back with another American Horror Story reaction. I feel like last week I just kept saying, this is so f***ed up, this is so f***ed up, this is so f***ed up. And I feel like this week I'll just be saying, this is so f***ed up, this is so f***ed up, this is so f***ed up. And you know why? Because this is so f***ed up. So let's just get straight into episode 7, Ave Hiesta. Ave Hestia, not Hiesta. I've already f***ed it up. Western Europe, 42 AD. Wow, how long ago was that? I'm sorry, I'm gonna to have to Google it. How long ago was 42 AD? Wow, so a lot of days ago. <laughs> I didn't want days, I wanted years. That's like when someone's talking about their baby and they say it's 523 days. Shut the fuck up. Also, when are they gonna do a full season of European horror stories? Because let's be honest, America, is running out of stories. I mean, they might do the Glasgow Willy Wonka experience next. Who knows? It's Ivy. Oh, no way. Back in 42 AD. We knew these bitches weren't aging, but that's a long fucking time ago. Oh, this is gross. <laughs> I can't even look. I can't even look. I can't even look. Okay, I'm gonna look. <laughs> oh, I can't show this on this channel at all, but she just ripped open her own stomach with a knife and now she's pulling out a baby. Hey, fancy another one? Oh, another one's coming out. It just stuck his hand out her stomach like it was the Undertaker in a Buried Alive match. Oh, here comes Feathered Ears. Who are you? Oh, we didn't get to see her unmask. It has to be Siobhan though, right? Brooklyn 2013. Is this going to be an entire flashback episode? Oh, the dead ex. Oh, the good boy. I've been wondering where he's been. We've not seen him for a few episodes now. Where the fuck is the good boy? Anna better not have turned him into golden retriever nuggets. Jesus Christ. I don't know about you guys, I wasn't really into Dex at first, but now I'm finding him really hot. <laughs> Look, she's got that zit on her face too. Okay, we get it, she's Gordon Ramsay. Same haircut too. It's fucking and Oh, we know how this is gonna go. Ave Hestia! She's got a secret room in the restaurant. Satan shit. <gasps> oh my god. Hi, Eddie. I was convinced Don't they were the same person. What do you want? Are they twins? To see my sister. <gasps> oh my god, Ivy gave birth to twins at the start of the episode. I'm gonna assume that that is these bitches. Anna is carrying twins. Has it all got something to do with evil twins? Every member of the Spellman family is born with a twine. Minus the E is twin. That's it! Cute how you told your chef to take off so you can have alone time. What could you say? Please leave so I can confront my evil twin who I pretend doesn't exist. Evil twin, there you go. Let's play. No. Calm down, Chucky. Hi, I'm Chucky, wanna play? <laughs> I like your accent, by the way. I can't quite nail American. One American twin and one British twin. It's giving parent trap. Holly, we're like twins. They missed the boat. They should have cast Lindsay Lohan in this role. That would have been hilarious. Addy, we need you. But I already left. And I know too much to ever go back. <laughs> oh, that's your worst fear as a kid. It'll be hard to keep him out. And here he's as stubborn as you are. Galway, Ireland, 1243. I'm sorry, but I have to do it again. How long ago was 1243? 780 years ago. So again, a long fucking time. Clearly nothing a bit of Botox can't fix. What is the matter, dear? I 
can't do it, Mother. I want to help people, not hurt them. Who is to say what is helping and what is hurting? So Sonia and Addy are Ivy's twins, and they've got really cringe Irish accents. Okay, maybe don't go ahead with European horror story if this is what it's going to be like. Addy obviously seems like the good twin. She doesn't want a part in anything they're doing. And Sonia, she seems like the the evil goth bitch twin. But what you're asking, Mother, is not for the greater good. It is only for her good. I think that's the first time we've saw any of these characters that we've been suspecting to be witches using actual power. I do not want to create evil, Mother. We cannot create anything. We're women. We're not allowed to! We can only choose whether to be right or happy. And which are you, Mother? I make the only choice. It is the placenta, Sonia. Really, Mother? There will be more. I, I can't even watch this. Rank. The spot? Blood bound. Blood? Together. Forever. Weirdos. Weirdos. My pretty little boy girl. What do you think happened? Uh, I don't know. She she keeps talking about her sister. I mean, I've had her sister sick, but I don't think that she's capable of something like this. I don't know. traumatized by her traumatized by her whole family they're all nightmares she won't even tell me their names well i'm sorry to hear that son yeah i hope she heals quickly all right Deb. you take care you too that boy's a mess so's that crazy wife of his she's not crazy she's something what the hell did i just tell you about contradicting me oh he's an evil I just fucking think cunt gentler with him I sold my startup. Oh my god. But I came out of nowhere, often no one could refuse. For a billion dollars. Somewhere between 700 billion and a trillion 300 million billion dollars. 1.2 to be precise. <gasps> what are you gonna do now? Mm, invest in Dex's gallery. Why are you doing this? Because I love you. And I want you to have it all. Well, we all know from last week's episode that Talia's in on this charade, so I can't exactly be happy for her right now, because she's up to no fucking good, that bitch. Plus, why is she so obsessed with Dex anyway? Excuse me. I just wanted to give compliments on the meal. Leave me the fuck alone. Mm. They miss you. Get those fucking things away from me. And they are growing up so fast. You don't want to keep your babies here as a keepsake? Get out of my restaurant right now. Such handsome little creatures. You grow in your own womb. I'm sorry, your baby's teeth? Handsome little creatures that you grew in your own womb? <laughs> what? Those are the teeth of her monster babies. I don't even know what a monster baby is, but do you know what? I think we're going to find out. Please, no more monster babies. We don't need any more monster babies. <gasps> Twinsies. Will that be all? Oh, she's so scary. <laughs> Pregnant. Shit. Is it going to be monster babies? Can she only have monster babies? It's my good time. <laughs> <laughs> So happy, young, fresh. It's the photo Anna found a few episodes ago. Oh, he's found the pregnancy test. Shit. Wow. 
Why are they taking her blood? Okay, so I can't show this on here at all. I, I don't even think I can show the audio, but Dexy's dad is shagging one of these feathered women from behind. She's in full outfit, full mask, and he's giving Dex full eye contact. I knew I would be seeing this. I knew I would be seeing it. This is so fucked up. This is so fucked up. Erase his memory? I wish I could erase my fucking memory after seeing that. Why do you hate me? I love you. You're my sister. Sister? I thought that was her mother. You're not my family. I renounced you. You have no power. Other than what she gives you. And takes away. As if defecting wasn't enough, you married him to give her the middle finger. Who are you to speak? You tried to leave too. Enough! Who are you? Guess. Guess. Who is behind the mask? Take it off! 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 Come on, come on! Take it off! Sold your soul to fill your company. Did you carry a creature? She carried several. Her womb is quite hospitable. You're not partnering with him. Oh, she's going to do more than that. She's going to pair him with his new wife. <laughs> he will be the one to carry and birth the purest product. Oh my god, they're cutting her stomach open. Oh. oh, you don't need dead babies in your skincare. It is the face of a child. <laughs> a newborn! <laughs> oh, someone should let these bitches know about kitty and skincare. That works just as good. I don't know what in the incest is going on here, but they all seem to be giving birth to these creatures. Is Dexy's dad the father of them all? Is Kim K under that feathered bitch outfit the mother of them all? Are they all related? Who fucking knows? I'm just gonna leave you with this clip from the start of the episode. You talk to me like I'm your child. It feels that way sometimes. Uh, because maybe he is? As if defecting wasn't enough, you married him to give her the middle finger. What do you think? Comment below and let me know your theories. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more and I will be back next week for episode 8. Just when you think it can't get any more fucked. It's more fucked!